If you work longer, you work harder, you should get paid for it. President Obama says unemployment is down and job growth is up on his watch, but middle class wages need a boost. So he wants to change the rules on overtime. Right now, workers in management positions making 25 grand don't have to be paid overtime. The president wants to lift the cap to 50,000. It's going to give as many as 5 million Americans, including 80,000 folks right here in Wisconsin, the overtime protections they deserve. The rule change is expected to have a big impact on restaurant employees, but the industry says the president's plan is not realistic. <music> president Obama's visit comes on the day Governor Walker was expected to file papers to run for president. His name did not specifically come up, but the president indirectly referred to Walker and other GOP presidential candidates that got the attention of the audience. Every single one of these candidates serving in Congress has supported cutting taxes for folks at the top while slashing investments in education. I know that sounds familiar. But for Republican supporters of Walker and his presidential ambitions, President Obama's economic message doesn't add up. But we still have failed to see action. You know, it's been six years, and the federal unemployment rate is still one percentage point, nearly one percentage point over the state unemployment rate. Governor Walker's been elected three times here in the state of Wisconsin in four years. President Obama knows the country's attention is going to start shifting towards the 2016 presidential election, but he says he's going to use his last year and a half in office to continue to work on the issues for middle class families. We're live in La Crosse, Charles Benson, today's TMJ4. Charles, thank you very much.